Welcome. E aí, galera, beleza? Bem-vindo à nossa comunidade. Welcome to our community. Hey, what's going on, guys? It's OGC here. Welcome to today's video. Today, I'm going to be showing you guys something absolutely insane when it comes to uh, Art of Conquest and creativity of the game and everything else. So, uh, what I'm showing you guys right now is uh, uh, right above me on the screen is my account. Uh, we'll be checking into this a little bit more. You'll, you'll be able to see it. Uh, and then on the other side, what takes up most of the screen is actually um, uh, a, a, a computer, a, a PC. So first, uh, let, let's just put out um, a reminder to everyone in our house that we have walls that are going to start. So what I want to show you guys is how to actually run walls um, when, when it comes to uh, uh, for, for your house. So this is a like a really good wall system. So uh, what it is, is it's on a PC, it's not just on, on the player. And before I do this, let me just point out one major thing. There's nothing illegal about this. Uh, this is all by the rules of Art of Conquest. Uh, there's no automated stuff at all. There's absolutely none of that. Everything is done by hand. Everything is legitimate accounts. Everything has been farmed meticulously by hand. This it has taken months upon months upon months. In some cases, for some of the accounts, absolutely years years of dedication to get it to this point so that being said there's absolutely nothing Ill uh, illegitimate about this everything is done a hundred percent through hand um and i will show you guys exactly what that looks like so uh on uh, the computer screen over here uh we are using a program called nox uh nox you can actually get um from, from downloading it online and what it looks like is uh we, we can actually go in and select uh multiple uh, clients to open up all, all at once. Uh, that way we, we can get a bunch of uh, bunch of walls going. So we have one, two, three. Uh, we should, should have one more popping up in, in a second. Uh, and each one of these is an individual account, uh, and unless I did not click one, uh, which I, I might not have. We'll, we'll figure that out afterwards. Um, so this is all uh, done by hand and I will show you guys exactly what it's like So if, if you see uh, the screen above me where we actually have my character walking all around We'll start to see blood moon people uh, start to walk in and we're going to start seeing alts popping into the game that are being generated from the from the computer So this is one of the reasons why I was able to get uh, what, what am I at right now? Um, uh, 150 uh, or 115 million honor in in a week is because of these alts. So they're actually right here. We have uh, d different ones that are popping in, and they're actually on on the computer over here. They're still loading. Their characters showed up beforehand, uh, but they are still coming in, and they are coming in hot. So it looks like we have uh, uh, two. Uh, all right, we we're we're definitely missing one. That's okay. We'll go with these uh with these three just uh just for demonstration's sake. So what I'm going to walk us through is uh what what it looks like to um and actually run it from the perspective of a wall runner. Uh, so yeah, we'll 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 jump into that. So the first thing that we're going to do, and we can do this all at once for all of them, is we're going to go in and we're going to shield up. So for all of the alts, uh. Lumber is super important. Uh, always grab grab uh, grab your, your lumber, uh, everything that you need, and we will go right on through, and then we'll get into the wall. Uh, so now that we're in here, uh, we're just going to put out to uh, Blood Moon that we are starting uh, because uh, we we want people here, and we will let them know now that we are starting. So now that we are starting, uh, what we're going to do is we're just going to come in and we're going to uh, shield up on all of the alt counts. So now everything is uh, has full uh, full shields, which is absolutely awesome. And what I like to do is I like to enter the city with all three of them, and then what I will do is one at a time uh, place them. So the the first one that we're going to place in is actually uh, the the governor or uh, a minister, I should say. So we're actually going to um, appoint him. Uh, I know it seems weird, but we're going to appoint them and also see if we can drop the tower uh, because that matters. Uh, we cannot drop the tower at this point in time. So now that this guy is actually all moved in uh, and he has his shield up, there is no repairs available. Uh, we can actually just exit right out of the account. 
Now with our main account, which uh, is directly above me on the screen, we just walk over, we select it, and uh, we, we make sure that we have plenty of honor available to collect with, and we do. We click it and attack, and we do our normal gameplay. So what we're going to do is we're going to kill this. Uh, <laughs> we have quite the army to do it. This is absolute overkill. But since I get distracted while, uh, while I do these uh, videos talking to you guys, I wanted all the overkill I can get uh, simply because um, I, I, I want all of the honor. I'm not doing this to uh, not get honor. That, that is for sure. All right, so uh, we're just doing all, all of our basic stuff. Um, pretty, pretty cool, pretty cool. So uh, what, what you guys uh, can see out of all of this is a lot of dedication that, that's gone into this, um, a lot of uh, work done by hand to create accounts. And if, if you have a team where you guys are willing to, to put in, in the, the hard work, you can actually create this yourself. You just need a, a computer and uh, the Knox program. It, it goes through uh, Android. Um, it's absolutely fantastic. So once you get it running, it takes a lot of time, guys. It takes a lot of time. Again, this is not something that was done a, a couple days ago. Most of these were started years ago. Uh, and everything has been done through by, by hand. So one of, the, one of the, the things is it's going to be around for for forever basically you're always going to get used out of having the uh wall accounts um it, it just is what it is so uh we will let this uh this one go down and since this one's going down uh we're going to wait one second afterwards that way all of our friends that that are attacking can also uh finish their attacks because we tend to go a little bit fast here at ogc uh simply because we want to make sure that we get all of the honor that we can so with one one of those attacks, we did 15.4 uh, million damage with our Warlock, so we can check it out. Um, it's directly above me. You'll be able to see all, all the, the goody stuff. Uh, let's see how much honor we got from that one attack. And just like that, we got 385,000 honor. Now on this, uh, this one computer, uh, as far as accounts, uh, there are many of them. So in one, one of these folders, there, there's like eight of them. Um, so... What we're going to do now is we will move in on the next account. And what, what's really cool with this is we can just move in with the account, exit out. And while we are waiting, um, we can actually queue up all of the uh, next accounts that, that we're going to do it with. So while, while we're waiting, we can have everything start loading because when you're doing this many things, uh, it's actually going to take, take a while for, for everything to load up. So what we're going to do is we're going to jump in again and we're going to clear out this wall because uh, hashtag YOLO, why not? Now, why why would somebody go through all of the effort to, to create an alt farm? Um, because the, the biggest benefits of, of creating an alt farm is uh, you and your house can actually farm an uh, insane amount of honor. You can minimize your potion use and you can get a lot of, uh, a lot of honor overall for your team. So if each castle that moves in, with each castle that, that's in there, every single person in your team can actually attack that uh, castle all at the same time and everybody will get full honor. So nobody has to fight over towers or anything like that. Um, if you customize all of your, your use, uh, you, you can actually um, make it so that you're able to use less potions than usual. Uh, clearly what I am doing right now, that is not the case. Um, <laughs> I am not d doing a good example of that at all, uh, but that is okay. And we forgot to do our turtle on time, but that is fine. So what we're going to do now is uh, we're just going to do all of the, the Raxia stuff and pop the Mana Worm. Although there's 5 million wall health left, uh, we're not going to be too concerned about it. Now that the four new clients ha have fully logged in, uh, what we're going to do is the same thing that we did before. We're just going to go inside of the castles. Uh, and there's a slight delay just because uh, it is a lot of uh, processing power that is happening on the computer right now. And we're going to go inside of the, the garrison for all of these. And we're going to shield on up. Now you might notice that this is taking taking some Lunari. But uh, in all reality, just having your, your accounts kind of sitting around collecting all the stuff from uh, either the Emperor or just uh, patch things that, that pop up. Um, you're, you're actually able to uh, get plenty of Lunari to, to run all of your walls. So what we're going to do, since we just got another 385,000 uh, honor, uh, we, we literally just filled up our, our honor tank. 
Uh, so since we just filled up the honor tank, uh, we're going to go redeem those. While we do that, we're going to place the next uh, next uh, castle in there. We're not really super worried about having to be the first person to attack this castle because we have teammates that will be able to do so. So you can do this for as many accounts as, as you would ever possibly dream to do. Um, but remember, you have to do all this by hand in order for this to be uh, legal, legitimate, um, which for all of these, it is all 100% done by hand. There are uh, people that have put in so much time and effort. Uh, it, it, it's absolutely insane. It, it's a job. Uh, it, it's literally its, its own job. So uh, because of that, uh, you're kind of limited by how much free time you have uh, for how many alt accounts you can have. Um, I highly recommend uh, probably at, at a minimum, uh, w which is like bearable to actually do and maintain because maintaining this is going to be everything. Uh, I would say at, at least eight accounts. Um, eight seems to be a, a relatively uh, safe number. It's not too much, it's not too little. And what I would recommend doing is um, uh, making those accounts and then uh, bringing them to whatever server you're, you're currently playing on and uh, you know, take the lumber from, from your, your main account. And uh, what we're going to do now is we're going to start putting down the Raxius Lanterns just so we can uh, get everything. I know this is mad overkill. Uh, I just, <laughs> I get a little nervous when I have so much multitasking going on. So I, I rather have the overkill and get all the honor than uh, miss out on anything. There's a couple other really important points that, that I want to point out for this. Um, points that I want to point out. One of them is whenever you do move the alt account in, uh, make sure that the shield is up. And if you are new new to this uh, or your team is new to this, make sure you tell your team not to attack until the shield is up. Oh, look at this. We, we got M.M. Chan here. Oh, look at all these cool people. All right, so we will go back in and uh, while we're all together, we're going to attack one more. All right, and then I will let you guys go. Um, it's pretty cool stuff all around as, as far as I'm concerned. I think this type of stuff's mad cool. As far as Blood Moon, uh, there are scores of accounts. Um, you can see in the top of the computer desktop screen, uh, all those files in, in the top up there, like folders, those each have uh, like at least four accounts in each, up to eight, and you can count those folders there. On the left, left hand side of the screen, uh, which is being covered covered up is other people's accounts, which is none of our business. But for Blood Moon, uh, if anybody is interested in, in ever coming to uh, Blood Moon, uh, all I can say is there are so many wall accounts uh, here for, for people to, to farm. Um, it is absolutely insane. If you go for a day where all it is is wall farming all day, uh, your eyes will want to like pop out of your head at the end of the day. You will be so tired of actually farming walls. Um, it is pretty crazy. There's people in the house with like half a billion honor and they don't even bother showing up to the, the wall farming because they are set for life when it comes to the alchemy zones, which uh, hopefully we will be uh, re relatively soon as well. Uh, that, that's, that's our goal. So uh, with that, guys, um, I hope that you guys have a fantastic day. Uh, we can make, make this account one bigger so you guys can see what I'm doing. Uh, <laughs> I, I hope you guys have a fantastic day. Make sure that you hit the uh, thumbs up button for for this video because this is some, uh, we're getting an inside peek into what the, the big houses get to do uh, in order to get the crazy uh, honor farm. Uh, this is uh, this is one of those tricks that not many people have the access to. If I was not in Blood Moon, if Blood Moon uh, told me I wasn't allowed to share this stuff, I wouldn't share this stuff. But uh, there's just some really big things in the game that if you want to spend the time to to master and get good at all of these little things or put in the time for these wallows for your team then uh there are ways to do it rather than uh just having it on your advice switching between uh servers each and every time that you, you go to do a wall it makes life so much easier when, when you do it this way i'm not going to get into the technical stuff on how it all works on the computer because uh, to be honest, I'm, I'm not uh, super good with uh, technical stuff in that sense. So we're going to go collect some more honor. We have some more walls to, to, to destroy. And you guys need to go down into the uh, 
into the description of this video and all videos um, and select one of those links. We have the merch store where you can get some really cool swagger. We have the uh, Discord where you can go there. You guys can ask all sorts of questions. Um, we have uh, the Patreon page, the best way to support this channel. We have so much amazing stuff down there. Go check it out as always. Please smash the thumbs up button, subscribe if you have not subscribed already. Hopefully your mind is blown and I look forward to seeing you guys tomorrow. Take care.